more people are now able to get their booster shots. The CDC approved making even more people eligible. Our Jalen Sojek is joining us live from the Shelby County Health Department. That's one of the places where people can get their boosters this morning. Good morning, Jalen. Yeah, Aaron, good morning. So people will be able to get their third shot here. It's going to be the Pfizer shot and they can do that today rest of the week and moving forward as well as other city run sites. So the Pipkin, which opens tomorrow, they will also be offering a third dose for people that are eligible. Now, for those that got the Pfizer or Moderna vaccine, the state says that the following groups are now eligible for their booster at six months or more after getting their second shot. So those people include 65 years and older people that are 18 who either live in a long term care setting or have underlying medical conditions, as well as people 18 and older who work or live in a high risk setting. Now, the people that are 18 and older who got the single shot of Johnson and Johnson, well, a booster dose is actually recommended at two or more months after the initial vaccine. Now, experts have said over time after getting the initial shot, vaccines are found to be less effective. So in one limited study, those who got the Johnson and Johnson shot saw their antibodies increase fourfold with a J and J booster. And they also saw a 35 fold increase with the Pfizer booster and with a Moderna booster, the antibodies increased 76 times. The boosters are really helpful. While the vaccines are working well in preventing severe infections, we are seeing breakthroughs and we see very clear evidence now that boosters, especially for high risk individuals, make an enormous difference in reducing those infections. Now you do not have to get the same shot for your third dose as what you got when you got vaccinated. So if you got Pfizer, you can get a Moderna booster. The CDC has come out and basically endorsed a mix and match strategy so that can open up the options for people. And if people just wanted to change the shot in general, if they got J and J, but they wanted to get a Pfizer booster, they're able to do that.